Frank Stella showed great artistic promise at a young age. He studied in high school at the Phillips Academy in Andover, Massachusetts. It was at that time, at that formative age, that he realized his true calling was to be an abstract painter and not to create figural art. In fact, later in life, Stella would comment that he was the first generation of American artists who grew up at a time in which abstraction was the norm. So Stella realized in his statement that he benefited so much from the artists who had come before him. After Phillips Academy, Stella studied at Princeton University in New Jersey. And in 1959, he was in the seminal exhibition, 16 American Artists at the Museum of Modern Art. He was 23 at the time. This exhibition introduced Stella to the New York art scene and his career and life were never the same again. The movement that we should most associate with Frank Stella is minimalism. He was a revolutionary minimalist artist, leading the charge in New York in the 19, late 1950s, 60s, and 70s, encouraging, in fact, a generation of artists to follow suit and also create minimalist large-scale works. These types of paintings can often appear flat when artists choose a particular type of color and then focus on geometric shapes across the canvas. But our Frank Stella is anything but flat. In fact, the curved forms uh, that appear across the canvas add a dynamic sense of movement, almost mimicking a type of dance. 